Hey everyone, welcome back. Um, here we are with our finished uh, skillet brownies. They turned out great, um, very hot. Of course, cast iron holds the heat really well. So um, I have them sitting here on some pot holders or you could use trivets, um, but I took them out using our silicone oven mitts. Um, so but I'm not gonna touch them anymore. I'm just gonna let them cool off here. But it took the 23 minutes, um, and I just used that cake tester, put it in, came out with moist, wet crumbs. Um, they've sunk in a little teeny bit, but really not much. And as you can see, it was a good thing we coated those white chocolate chips with the flour because they stayed right on top. So, um, and as promised, I do have a special guest that's going to join us for a sampling now, this is still hot, special guest, so I want, in full disclosure, do not burn yourself. So I would like to welcome my husband, David, to come sample. And got you a spoon. We're going to, okay. we can try one together. So the middle will be like gooier and the outside will be like crispier. I want the gooier part. I know you do. Now, it's hot, so be careful. And it's cooked through perfect, didn't stick to the bottom of the cast iron. Mm. Not hot at all. Mm. Cooled off good. And I mean, yeah, take another, I'll take another bite too. It's so good. That vanilla flavor. Kind of? mine. Okay. Well, I just want to show how it didn't stick. Mm. That's good. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. That is so good. And that was really, like, I, it was easy. That was a quarter cup of flour. I mean, not a lot of ingredients. And, like, I think I said before that would be good to share. No. I, I would eat that myself. Um. That'd be great with um, some ice cream. You could do it a la mode um, or some homemade whipped cream, some spiked whipped cream. But if you look in, in there, is, if you remember, we didn't grease that cast iron at all. We didn't really do anything. I just washed it before I cooked in it um, when I first got it. But no spray of, all, of um, nonstick spray or any oil or anything. There is nothing stuck to that. So when I go to rinse that, I'll give it a... Once over with some hot water, use my little scraper, just if anything's stuck on in the corners at all. But that was great. Those turned out perfect. Um, super simple to get together. That was definitely something the kids could put together. I mean, other than just making sure you help them get the hot um, stuff out of the microwave and then handle these hot cast iron skillets. They're super cute. Um, you can mix them up, put whatever kind of topping you want on there. Um, but I hope you enjoy, and um, I hope you enjoyed my special guest. I know I'm kind of fond of him, but that's you know, just me. Um, but if I can be of any help for you with any of your Pringle Chef needs, um, please look me up. I would love to help you, and thanks for watching. And if you like these, please um, subscribe to my YouTube channel to follow me to see more um, exclusive content. Um, you have a good day, then. See you later.